Almost there. Whoa! There's Miratero! We're so close! I bet Spirit and Chikalinda can make it there in no time. Yeah, but Lucky, now that we're up, how do we get down? Oh, no, no, no. I could handle being lost, and the snakes, and Boomerang. I guess not really Boomerang, but this? This day started out so simple. All I wanted was to get back in time for lunch. And I just wanted a nice ride home. Was that so much to ask? We're doomed. We're so doomed. I know, boy, but we can't just rush into this. I wish Abigail were here. She'd know just what to say to make me laugh, and then we wouldn't even think about it. We need Abigail's positivity to distract us from all the danger we're in. The last time I went rock hopping, I collected so many geodes, you could have called me Geogale. Did that work? Kinda. I did want to laugh, but at you. It'll have to be good enough. Come on, let's do this. Whatever you say, Geogale. <laughs> <laughs> this poultice should pull the snake poison from the wound. I have seen it work once before, but not on a horse. When did you see it? In my tribe. Healing like this is common. My Amasani is a healer, and once a man came to her with a snake bite. I helped her make this poultice, and it saved his life. This will help, boy. Please be still. Now, for the second part of the healing. Abigail, I need you to make something. What? A salve? A knot? Another poultice? I need you to make your jokes. How can that be helpful? Your horse can feel that you are worried. He's trying to comfort you. He must stop moving. You must assure him you are not worried by being Abigail again. The true Abigail. I can try to be the true Abigail again. I will be seriously silly. One day, I hope they make popcorn flavored ice cream. Because every time I want something sweet and salty, I put popcorn in my ice cream, but then the popcorn gets soggy and the ice cream gets gross. <laughs> Why don't they sell hot chocolate in the summer? I guess if they did, it would just be cold chocolate. Cold chocolate! Genius! I gotta tell Winthrop! If I had a penny in one hand, a dime in the other, I'd have money. Or coins, at least. Is it working? Do I sound like her? If fruits and nuts were ifs and buts, we'd... How's it go? Oh, yeah. We'd have a Merry Christmas! <sighs> Your turn! Okay, but I'm not attempting the Abigail voice again. Um, okay. Clouds! They are so fluffy! They're made of water, which is two parts hydrogen and one part oxygen. That's why they call it H2O! <sighs> Turtles can live really long lives. Just keep talking. That's what Abigail does. Do you think fairies live in these rocks? If there were fairies in rocks, they'd be frogs. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. I didn't think I could take another second of the tension or I would just explode. Hey, that sounded just like Abigail. You're finally getting it. Now, let's go find your mom. <laughs> <laughs> 